you started Ojo in 2015. I think yep. Ben started um, Op City. Uh, yeah, Op City in 2015. And 2016, like, in a, yeah. And in a very short time period, he sold that for a couple hundred million dollars to Realtor.com. Yeah. What did, I mean, you know, how do you, I mean, you've been working on something now and like, yeah. I feel like it hasn't even truly gone to the market yet. Yep. Yep. <laughs> Like you, you've been baking the cake for the last five, six years, and um, he was able to build it up and sell. What's the, uh, what's that competitive environment look like between you two guys now? Yeah, um, two things. One, there's a little bit of bias here. I was a big investor in Op City, and Ben's a big investor in Ojo, so ah, we, we okay. are just above friendship, pretty supportive <laughs> of each other's successful outcomes. Look, I think I think if Ben could do it again he would have liked to keep Op City independent. Sometimes as yeah. a, you know, it's a, it was a nice success, but we're entrepreneurs. We want to build big things, yeah. right? I have been obsessed <laughs> from the very beginning of this company on controlling its destiny and selling it on my own timeline or taking it public on my own timeline and ensuring that we never had our back against a wall. And so we've raised a lot of money We've done all of these different things so that we could build a really big company. And now, like, you're, you're right on one hand, some of the problems we were trying to solve, kind of like nurturing consumers with digital advisors, getting some of these products patented, a couple of years to build the technology for the sales center to be all integrated. But now, like, you know, last month, we have accelerated Movoto to have 35 million people coming to it. You got hundreds of thousands of people engaging on the platform. And so we, we, I, it's, a, it's like bamboo. Bamboo takes three years to grow six inches. Yeah. And then it grows six inches a day. That's really where we are now, if you see it. And so it, yeah. was, it was really, it's just a different game plan versus kind of scale quick, but then have to sell early versus... Yeah really deep scaling, control your own yeah. destiny and build a monster business. So um, the, the mission statement of Zillow is to build a marketplace for real estate. And that's a relatively yeah. new mission statement they created. Um, like to, you, I, I want to see them do it. Yeah. Do you, do you view them as a, as a competitor? You know, look, I'm an, I'm a entrepreneur. And so the answer is the right answer is I don't have any competition. I don't see anything yeah. like us. But obviously, uh, in yeah. reality, yeah. anybody that is attempting to meet a consumer in the beginning of their home journey and yeah. then hold on to them to serve them is a very serious competitor. Therefore, yeah, Zillow is a co competitor for me for sure. So, uh, and, I, and, I, and I think like Zillow, uh, we're all very lucky that Zillow did not act upon what should have been, I believe, their approach from the beginning, given the backgrounds that they all had from, from uh, travel marketplaces, they should have been running a marketplace really effectively from the beginning. If they did, we wouldn't have a right to exist. What I think you, we're on the right track now. We'll see if they can move to it quick enough. So you guys are kind of like Instagram, trying to catch up to Facebook, and Zillow's kind of like Facebook. <laughs> What, like, you know, what do you do to can I call them? Can I call them MySpace? Is that okay? Yeah, there you go. <laughs> hey, there it is. There it is. Uh, uh, yeah. So you guys are, you guys all are respect, all respect to the Zillow team there. No, no, I love it, man. I love it. So like, what, like, what is it you guys are going to do to overtake the behemoth? What's that, what's that strategy look like? You know, what I, the way I think about it is I'm not trying to go beat you know, Zillow or, or Realtor at top oh. of the funnel traffic acquisition. Oh, I'm trying to beat them, but hold on. Uh, I'm not trying to beat That's them. That's bullshit by, right there. Come on. No, no, but listen, I'm not trying to beat them by just having more people show up to my website. Where I'm trying to beat them is higher throughput. Because what I want to be able to tell you is factually with deep evidence, if your mom's going to go buy a house, she should come to our site over every other site.